Hey guys, real quick, I just want to remind you that Blue Water Cruising is having another live online workshop on Sunday, July 9th at 3 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Keith and Chris will share the secrets that society doesn't want you to know about how to get out of the rat race and live a life of freedom and adventure. Hop over to bluewatercruisingplan.com and sign up today. The link is also in the video description. And now, on to today's show. Last week, we put the boat back in the water after being on the hard for two weeks. We also introduced you to our new crew so far, Gabriella from Brazil, Madeline from Oklahoma, Luke from Florida, and Glory from Canada. We then set sail to Samos, where we'll pick up the last crew member, Hanam from Saudi Arabia. So this is called bow dragging. I do not condone it, nor will I be participating in it, but the kids seem to like it. <laughs> I love it! Oh my God! And why is Pythagoria famous? Mathematics. And what exactly? That that man man. Theorem. Now, hey, was my finger pointed at you, Mr. Whitebread? I don't know how to say it. Theorem is Pythagoras. Pythagoras theorem. And what's Pythagoras theorem? Do you know what it say? is? What is it? What is it? Well, if you have a triangle that has a 90, 90, 90 degree angle, if you have two sides of it, you can find the third one. So oh. engineering. A squared plus B squared equals C squared. Yes. Yeah. And why Why did it... That's something you guys ought to go see. Uh, they built a, a, a... Back when the Romans were attacking and the Greeks... Uh, I don't know who was attacking, but a lot of people were attacking this island. They, they uh, built a water cave to take water uh, from up in the spring down here to where the fortress was, and they tunneled through the mountain. Wow. It's crazy. They kept it flat, and they made a tunnel through. I mean, not a short tunnel. This thing's like two miles long. All the way through the mountain, hand dug it, and kept it level, and came up to the spring, and we're up in the mountains there, and the water runs down, and it fed the city that was surrounded by a fort so that they could be safe in, in Pythagorean. It was an anticlimactic tunnel. It was, but it, what's cool Sorry. about it is the engineering that went in the ball. You the really tunnel. like it, yeah. 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 And to think that they did that. Like yeah, 6,000 years or 5,000 years, whatever long ago it was. It's crazy. So this crew we have now, they're all very skilled at filming and video editing. So we've decided to put them to work. They'll film and publish their own episodes on Mondays right here on our channel. So hop back over here on Mondays too for more new Med Crew adventures.
go. I think we're in good shape. I know, for me too. <laughs> we need girls are it's editing. It's a little spider web. Wait, go back this morning. Two. It's about one little charged up. Uh, I set it to charge this but morning. It should be full. Cool. You're right, that's actually something we're gonna play. Where are you going? I don't know. Like that baby. Play. Around? Gabriella is managing laundry. Yes, I am. You're such a good girl. I it's like we haven't done laundry in a week or something. Yeah, there was so a lot much. of laundry to do. <laughs> but I enjoy it. I actually like it. She walks across the room. Luke's still sleeping? That's Luke's room. The captain's peak. Mmm. How are you doing, Jack? I'm very good. I woke up about 30 minutes ago. Yeah? Mm hmm. 30 minutes ago? Mm hmm. We get Ganon today. Yes, we do. I'm excited for him to get here, and it's Finn's birthday today, which we're going to be making a cake and doing some fun stuff. Yeah. So you get your own bed as normal. Hey, You're the we, only we, one that we gets. Don't, we don't need to film that. That's just a little messy right now. It is not. Not compared to everybody else's. Mm -hmm. Everybody else has to share, except yeah. for Finn. Finn is in the kite room. He shares a bed with kites. Uh, no, not actually. His bed is clean. His bed is not clean. No, it's cleaned <laughs> it off. Yeah. He's got but. all his clothes on it. I just never sleep under the actual covers. I just use my, my top yeah. covers. Cool. So Maddie mm -hmm. and Kate mm -hmm. share Kate's bed, mm -hmm. which is uh, looks like a uh, tornado came through. I know. There. I'm literally cleaning it as we speak. <laughs> yeah, really. That's what cleaning. Looks like. I. I you, you're you're getting ready to clean. No, it. I was cleaning it, but then I took like a little stopping point because I needed to apply to this. Cool. And then Finn moved into this room which was our storage room, and he just put all of his junk right there in the corner. And Glory and Gabriella are sharing uh, Finn's room, his big old bed. So they have their own bed and their own bathroom and some privacy. You see the lines? Yep. One dilly manilly. Okay. Dry it right out. Looks nice. Where are we going, Jack? Airport though. I don't know why all of us are going. Well just to just to welcome him so he can have a whole crew. Taking two cars. Girl car and a boy car. So yesterday was Finn's birthday, but Ganam gets here today and we're going to celebrate it, Finn's birthday today. And so Finn, Jack, Luke, Ganam are going to go and take Finn into town while me and the girls set up some a little surprise party for him. Just yeah. like a cake and some balloons and stuff. That's, so, cool. that's what we're going to do. Finn is 17. 17 years old. 17. What is it? Uh, Dancing Queen? Seven. Yeah. Seven. <laughs> and Queen. Betty and the song 17. There's many. 17 is the year for music for sure. Okay. We're so excited. Hey, Kanam. Welcome to the Mad Crew. We are, ready. We are so excited. We are for waiting for you, for you right now. So, so the reason like he's late is because his Greek visa was late or something. Saudi Arabia, it doesn't, I don't know, they're not involved in the Schengen partnership program whatever so he had to get something different and it took him longer so that's why he's late welcome to the boat you've seen a million times probably <laughs> alright so how exactly do you pronounce your name Yes, sir. You got a first try. <laughs> yes, sir. Okay, cool. I think you get top bunk. All right. Sounds good. The girls are starting the, the preparations of the baking. Secret birthday surprise. Okay, we're going to do this one. This one simple. Small cars. Film set here. We got to very, very cram everybody in. Got to get close. And now, Greece has little bitty bitty cars. Is your family friends with the royal family? Ooh. Yes, best friends. Are you really? Actually? No, 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 no. <laughs> oh. oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> god. Do, 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 do y'all know them? Yeah. Do you know them personally? No. 
No. It's like a, asking... I've, I've actually at one time uh, gave a tour to a uh, royal princess. Really? And, uh, yeah, at the uh, Hasaya Gala Mountain. Yeah. I used to give tours there, and she came like out of out of sudden. So uh, that That's was cool. pretty fun. That's cool. Yeah. Yes. All right, this is some kind of Greek museum. I'm gonna check it out. Meanwhile, back at the house, Kate and Maddie came back early <laughs> oh, to yeah. plan a little mini party for Finn. And as per normal, Keith is, uh, oh, he is uh, straddling an engine, uh, fixing something. Is it ready? Negative. Yeah. Oh, hi. It's cooking too fast, oh. and so the middle is not cooking. Oh no. Did you turn the temp down? <laughs> yeah. Yay. 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 I'm not seven years old. Hey, I didn't even get candles on my birthday, okay? Happy birthday, Happy birthday to you. you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Finn. Today we're gonna go to a tunnel. I don't actually know what it is, but I think it's a little tunnel that's a part of the museum. And we get to wear hard hats and walk into where they chipped out a whole tunnel in the ancient times. So here we go. Going to the caves. Going to the caves, Yasu. 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 Hey, hey, hey. I somehow ended up in the boys' car. Yalla. This feels like some kind of jail cell. Oh my god. Alright, what's going on YouTube? So we are at this like cave thing where it goes right through the mountain. They built this ages ago. Mm -hmm. I think it was two guys. And uh no, probably more than that. It was probably way more than that. But um And so us we decided that we were gonna go and walk through the tunnel, we have to put on a hat, hard hat, but Renee's not coming, so you're getting us, the vloggers. Yalla. Keeps like, Kanam, you have been here hey. for 24 hours. How do you feel? I feel like out of this world. Yeah? Yeah. Has it been everything you've expected? Um, no, nah, not really. <laughs> It's, it's a little bit of fun, expect I tried not to put any expectations, honestly. I think that's better. So I'm having fun right now. It's great. Let's go. Yeah, you're on. Hey, like a lunch lady. Hey, oh, we're gonna leave this is for protection. I don't think it looks very good, but you know, safety first. So this is for fashion statements, just so we don't want to get our hair in the food that we're gonna eat. <laughs> I'm kidding, I have no idea why we're wearing this white thing. Um, I gotta get so don't get lice. <laughs> I, gotta, I gotta get a photo of this. This is good lining. How do we, how do we turn it so oh. We're ready to go to the tunnel. Really, this is a fashion statement. We're spelunking. We've never been deeper in the earth. We're near the core of the earth and we can feel the heat. Is it radiating? We are at the Upilanos Caves right now. It reminds me of my time in the Gar Mountain as a tour guide. It's just pretty much the same thing, except that you could die here. Never, never, never. Oh my God. <laughs> 
So cool. Like, oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> I think I think I've hit my head the most out of oh. anybody. Are you what are we eating the goodie right now? Are you what are we eating the goodies? Oh my god. We did it. Oh my god. In 20 minutes. Really? 20 minutes or less. Gabriella. Let's go. Oh. Renee, I hope you have a really good time editing this. I'm sorry if the footage was really eclectic, but we love you so much. We do love you. Is that a gang sign? You're the reason I'm here. Yeah. No. You're the reason we're all here. Uh, yeah. I love that you're still wearing the Because if you wouldn't have had kids, <laughs> I look like. you probably wouldn't have made a YouTube channel. And then and then they wouldn't the have needed friends, and then we wouldn't be here. And then we wouldn't be here. All right, we can walk so, down to the, the sliding of you, girl. Nah, you know. Nah, nah. We're gonna run back home. We're gonna get that exercise. The grind is on. Let's go. I'm wearing chacos. This is a bad idea. Augie, stop walking towards us. Let's get out of here. You're ruining my shot. You guys just ruined my shot. I'm editing something. Sorry. Right now. No. Yeah. Where are we going right now? Right now we're heading back to the boat. We're gonna chill, eat some lunch, and then see what happens. Uh, it's been a pretty relaxing day. It's pretty hot, fairly hot. You know, we're having a good time though. We're out here, and uh, we'll take it back to you, Stan. Strong, independent. Oh, grab one of these flowers. Almost back to the boat right now, but it is getting really hot. We're burning up here. Burning. There's a reason they call it Hellenistic. Because it's like hell. It's the hot as hell. <laughs> I don't that, know if you can put that in the video. Is that but the name of this town? No. Oh. Greece is a Hellenistic country. Oh, really? So. Huh. It's hot I didn't as hell. know that. I think it's been two weeks on the boat now, and I have loved every second. I'm not just saying that, like genuinely this way of life is starting to make so much sense. Oh, all the fun things that we get to do and seeing just Keith and Renee and how they do things around the bow and how the family interacts, it's amazing. A common theme that's a highlight of mine is the dance parties. Keith will just be like, hey, who wants to come have a dance party slash karaoke night on deck? And even if we're doing an activity, there's still music going and we're still dancing through the whole thing. Hi guys, it's been two weeks and I am not tired yet. And I don't think I'll ever get tired of it. This life is made for me. I am so happy. It's gonna be so hard to leave. I don't know why I'm laughing like, Oh, I'm just so happy to be here. I have been working on Med Crew Mondays. Us crew, we decided that we were going to take back a little bit of the Teen Yacht Tuesday that um, Sailing Guitar used to do. Me and Maddie have primarily been working on the edits and filming, and then all of the Med Crew has been a part of it, and it's it's been really fun. I've been really enjoying working on it. We have some funny moments. I don't think I've laughed as hard as when I'm editing those videos. It's been so much fun. So, I look a little bit different from the last time you saw me. I got two stitches on my chin. Okay, we're two weeks in, but already I'm like, this can't end. I don't want it to end. We are heading to Patmos today, actually a little island south of Patmos, where there's some caves. 
And tomorrow we're heading to Patmos, or the next day. And then we're heading back around towards, uh, I don't know, Pharaoh Islands, maybe? I can't remember the name of the island. But then we're heading to Athens, and that's where we should be back there in about two and a half, three weeks with a four-week adventure. It's been a four-week adventure, five-week actually. Four or five weeks of adventure comes to conclusion. So we're anchored here at these caves. The wind's out of the south uh, east right now, and gusty 18, and we're anchored in this real tight area here. So we shore tied over here to the, to the west side. The wind's gonna clock around to the southwest tonight, and uh, it'll be pushing us off the rocks. Our anchor's set deep. Jack just checked the anchor, so it's set down in the sand good. So we should be in good shape with the, the shore ties and the anchor for the night. Let's hope that stays the way it is. Oh, 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 oh,
stuff rolling on. Now let me take us through the rules here. Like, what does it mean to be out? You have to have both your hands, leave the mat, and be fully in the water. Fully in the water. No contact with the... Oh! Oklahoma, I right here representing. I have never seen Maddie get any, uh, any aggression out, so maybe she'll do here. All right, look, count down. Let's go in three, two, one. deal here, like the Civil War, North and South. These boys will either go all in or they'll be, what's that? All right, count them down. All right, we're going to go in three, two, one, go! Oh, uh, did you see that charge? Right out of the box, they hit each other. Bam! In steam. Oh, 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 it was bad, it wasn't good, it was too quick, he was lightning fast, and I was not prepared. Well, we saw that, you guys really charged hard in the beginning, and then he just kind of upended you. What did you think when you hit the water? Shit! <laughs> Three, two, one, go! Look at that. This kind of took that sideways, bud. Man, if you can just get that leg up, yeah, there you go. Like he's wrestled before. Yeah. Oh, Danny, a tough spot again. Let him have a draw. Let him have a draw. Oh, look at the recovery there, Luke. What do you think about that? It's fun to ever come up with that. Oh my gosh. Oh, my I'm just holding on tight, looking all over. Finish. Oh, champion has been taken down. Winner, world champion today. What do you think about that? On top of all of the great things that we've been doing the last couple days um, in the last week, we also gained our last crew member. His name is Hanam. 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 I don't know. What is up, everyone? This is Hanam. I'm 18 years old and I'm from Saudi Arabia. I've grew up in the eastern province of Saudi Arabia in a city called Al Hesa, which is basically the biggest oasis in the world. So I have not had much access to sea life my life before. So this is this experience is just super fun for me. It's been two days right now and I'm already comfortable with the crew. The first day I was a little nervous and awkward, but on the second day that kind of just washed away. I think my favorite thing that we've done thus far probably has been bow dragging. We so basically you jump, the boat's moving, and you're standing at the front and you jump off and then they set up ropes so you can like grab the ropes and you're like just dragging in the middle between the two, I'm, I don't know the boat terminology, the, you're dragging in the middle of the boat and then you just like let go and you grab another rope and you pull yourself up the back and then like jump off the front again and I think that that's my favorite thing that we've done thus far. I look a little bit different from the last time you saw me. I got two stitches on my chin. A couple days ago, we were biking. Everything's going good. I'm, I'm pr I feel like I'm pretty good at biking. Um, that's one of my favorite sports is mountain biking. So I was like, oh, I'm good. Like, if anyone falls, it's not gonna be me and I can just help them. About 30 minutes into the ride, we start climbing up this mountain. We finally get to the top. It's this huge downhill. We're just flying down. Everyone's passing each other, having a good time. And I thought it'd be funny if I just flew past everyone and was just going as fast as I could. Uh, so I did that, I was zooming past everyone and I there's a turn, like a super sharp turn. I grabbed the back brake and I was slowing down and I was leaning over on the bike like I would back home on mine. Going around the turn, I fully make it almost and right at the end of the turn, I had to hit some gravel or something in my front tire and it just went boom! And I go over and just slam my chin on the concrete and I look behind me and there's this huge truck and I'm like, oh my gosh. So as I'm like rolling on the ground, I'm like frantically trying to get out of the road and I grab my bike and then I look to my right and I see Finn just flying by me, just smiling. And I'm like, oh my gosh. Definitely a highlight was biking. The girls 
actually got separated. We took the wrong turn and anyway, but we ended up biking on this like countryside and it was so pretty. That was probably a highlight for sure, other than the fact that Luke busted his chin. That was kind of a bummer, but there's also like a joint trauma thing. Like we all got to uh, huddle around him and take lots of pictures of him. Luckily, Keith and Renee were in the town of Samos right by us. And uh, they drove up, took them like five minutes. We drove to a hospital. I thought it was gonna be like a American hospital. Just like you walk in and you have to wait a little bit and everybody's nice and greeting you. Well, we get to this place and it looks like an insane asylum. Like, it is crazy. We go into the room, uh, he immediately sits me down on the chair and just starts touching my face and looking at it and spreading it open. I'm like, whoa, whoa, whoa. I'm like, like you didn't even ask me for my name or anything. Like, you haven't even taken my insurance. And uh, he was like, no insurance, it's free. And I was like, what? Like, however the stitch is free, Keith is in the room just looking over because he also knows how to stitch. He wanted to stitch me up initially, but I was like, ah, I kind of want a doctor, I want a professional. I kind of wish he did it now because the doctor was like, uh, it wasn't an American doctor. He makes Keith leave the room and I'm just here by myself with people who don't know how to speak English. And I have this huge cut on my face and I'm like, I'm gonna die here. This is where I die. He puts uh, like four shots of lidocaine to numb all the all the area, and uh, then he just starts going to town with stitches. And I was literally in and out of the hospital in probably 15 minutes max. It was crazy. I was supposed to sleep in the bunks, but they were a little too small for me. I don't know. It felt a little weird sleeping there. It wasn't really comfortable, so I kind of just took my bed and slept out on the upper deck which was pretty fun. It was breezy, spacious, and you could hear the waves. It's been so great every time I go to bed. I'm exhausted, just I completely pass out on my bed. We've been doing so much. We actually just did some cliff jumping and it was great. We did jumping off the bow. That was one of my favorite things we've done so far. Everybody's getting along really well. I'm sleeping with Madeline. Madel Maddie currently, I'm sleeping with Maddie. Um, and before I was sleeping with Glory at the Airbnb, but now I'm sleeping with Maddie. And we're getting along great. Everybody is, Ganam just got here, yes, two, two, two days ago, three, two, two days ago. Yeah, and it's been a great time having him here. And I'm excited to see what else is going to happen. Ah! <laughs> Oi, gente. Oi, família, amigos. Meu Deus, eu tô muito, muito, muito feliz. Estou sendo uma experiência incrível. É... Não sei muito bem o que falar. Um beijo para todo mundo que está me acompanhando. Eu estou muito feliz de estar aqui. Isso está sendo incrível. Meu Deus, é muita adrenalina, muita felicidade, muita emoção. Eu não sei o que falar, porque ela vai editar e ela não vai entender nada. Então ela vai deixar o vídeo inteiro completo. Então eu não posso errar o que eu estou falando. Enfim, gente, estou muito feliz de estar aqui. Um beijo para minha família, amo vocês. Estou morrendo de saudade. Obrigada por me proporcionar essa oportunidade. Um beijo para minha prima Ana Liz, que quer um beijo. Que pediu pra mandar um beijo. E é isso, gente. Tô muito feliz, tô muito feliz. Obrigada a todos os brasileiros que estão me acompanhando. I guess that's it. So, bye guys. I'll see you in the next video. Or, I'm gonna see you in Med Crew Monday. Just watch it. Just, just watch it. It's just fun.